Uh, hi, I'm Awesome Ashby, and this is Awesome Ashby Eats. Uh, we are going to talk about self-love and weight loss, which are actually the two things I focus on the most right now. Self-love and weight loss, uh, and how they're correlated together. Um, today we're doing seared scallops, which is pure protein and super delicious. I'm from Florida and we love all of the seafood down there. Um, I'm in Hollywood, California right now, so definitely a coastal, bi-coastal girl, uh, lady, woman, what? Um, so I do love all of the creatures from the sea, clams, eh. but otherwise, big fan, rock shrimp, oh my gosh, the best. I feel like they've gotten small over the years. This is not about the environment. But I have a lot of feelings on fish. So as you can see, there's butter melting in my cast iron skillet behind me. Super hot. Be very careful. Um, if you've never done this, uh, uh, do it with a friend for the first time. So cast iron skillet is a, such a great tool to have in the kitchen. You can get it super duper 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 hot. Um, and you don't want to wash it in the dishwasher ever. Uh, to wash a cast iron skillet, you want to get um, like tough sea salt, you know, coarse sea salt and olive oil and heat it up and then uh, take a paper towel and that'll clean out any gunk that's in the cast iron skillet. Never wash it with soap. It keeps all the seasonings from all the food that you make in it and then over time it's just like its own unique personality item. Okay, so enough about the cast iron. Uh, we're getting it really hot right now. You can hear it sizzle. I have some scallops right here that I've uh, sprinkled some sea salt on. And then I'm going to sprinkle some green onions on them once they're almost done cooking. So how you sear scallops is you have to get that uh, pan really hot. That's why I'm talking to you while it gets super hot. And then I will cook the scallops and show you how delicious they are. <laughs> so today's word, because there's a word of the day every day. Oh. Okay, so I <laughs> I have found the word of the day, and I think it just makes the most perfect sense for um, how that all worked out. I was looking for it in my pocket, and it was there, and I didn't. I I I yeah. Anyways. <clears throat> The word for the day is balance. 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 Balance is a huge part of self love. Yes, balance is a huge part of self love. Um, when we don't have balance in our life, let me read you the definition uh, because I like this balance better. Okay. <clears throat> balance. Balance is insanely important in self love and weight loss. And like I was saying, that's kind of what I'm doing here is telling you how they go together, right? I want you to get healthy. I want you to lose weight. I think I'm going to do some confessionals where I tell you like tricks and tips and like that way there's things you want to write down of like how I live my life as far as what I eat and all that kind of stuff goes so that you can join me on this journey. I'm all about that. Um, and the pan is getting hot enough. But I want to talk to you about the word of the day, which is balance. The two definitions I found for balance are an even distribution of weight enabling someone or something to remain upright and steady. And not just like spoke to me because both have to do with self-love. Um, same with the second definition. Balance, a condition in which different elements are equal or in correct proportions. When we have imbalance in our diet or when we have imbalance in our life, it creates an imbalance in ourselves, right? So it's really important if we feel that there are things in our lives that are not serving us, that are not like loving us or 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 going 50-50 with us like we think they should be, we need to address those things. You know, don't sweep it under the rug, right? We want to make sure we have a balanced diet and a balanced life for all of the self-love, right? Self-love is my mantra. Self-love is the key. Uh, weight loss has a lot to do with how much you love yourself and take care of yourself. And I'm not saying that people who are fat don't love themselves. I am not saying that. Ashley Graham is like my idol, okay? I own the book. She is an inspiration. Um, I am saying that for me, self-love was correlated to my weight gain uh, because I wasn't overweight as a child. And it is through self-love that I found my ultimate inner happiness uh, and I just want to share that with you. So I love, I love all um, I love all people and we need to start cooking these scallops. Big, fat, tall, short, 
all the colors of the rainbow, all the genders, all the sexes. I love everybody. I just want everybody to love themselves. So if that's something that you're working on like me, I want you to join me. But before I set my kitchen on fire, let's sear some scallops. Hello! We gotta make it exciting. I mean, I'm not emerald. Okay, make sure you turn the, um, the, and we're done. Uh, make sure you turn it off, but these beautiful seared scallops, I'm probably just going to eat right out of the bowl um, because they're delicious and pure protein, um, and there's nothing wrong with them. And they smell really good. You could put it on a salad. You could put it with um, a healthy carb like quinoa and um, and a vegetable uh, like the vegetables that we did on Monday. Um, there's so many things you can do with delicious seafood, seared seafood, grilled seafood. I love seafood. Um, if you're not interested in seafood, I understand. We have other episodes and we make other foods, uh, but I definitely uh, highly recommend any kind of seafood. It's pure brain food and it's pure protein and it's so good for you. Um, yeah, so seared scallops uh, that I'm serving them in a bowl, but I feel like that's okay. I can eat them any way I want because I love myself. Uh, and the word of the day is balance. Thank you so much for hanging out with me while I made seared scallops. Uh, I hope you make some seared scallops. Say seared scallops five times fast. Seared scallops, you'll say, nope, can't do it. So, <laughs> thank you for joining me. Thank you for thinking about balance because it's really, really important. And uh, I hope to see you again uh, next, next time. I'm trying to post these Wednesday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So that way there's one every other day during the week for you uh, because I know that there's a lot of cooking to be done uh, and food to be made. And I want to share that with you. Uh, so until next time, Love yourself. Bye.